Like I say, for you guys who are new, what we've basically been doing is we've been playing Arena and I've been asking you guys basically to help me choose my deck. So we're going to do that again. Now we have more people in. This could be kind of interesting to see what you guys pick. So just the first part then. Who should we choose then? Who should we choose as our hero? Should we have the Paladin, the Warrior, or the Rogue? Now, personally, I do not care. I actually really like everyone. So I'd love to hear what you guys think. But yeah, Pro luckily it's not Priest again. I don't want to go for Priest. Someone's saying Ufa. So one for Ufa then. We've got one for Paladin. Anything else? Who else wants me to choose? Who else do would you guys like me to be? We got Lightbringer. <laughs> I knew people would say that as soon as I as soon as I saw his name pop up, I was like, okay, people are gonna say Lightbringer. Uh, Ufa. Yeah, a lot of people are saying Ufa. Might have to go. No problem, Marcus. It's no problem at all. Of course not. Don't worry. Have a good night. It was awesome to have you with us. Yeah, it looks as though most people are saying Ufa. Let's go for Ufa Lightbringer then. Perfect. Okay, so I need you guys to pick my deck, so we're going to go through this very quickly. So every time the cards pop up, just type in which one you think I should pick. Because um, we just need to go as quick as possible. I don't want to take too long. So here we go. We've got Emperor Cobra. This can destroy any minion, which is quite useful. We have uh, the Dragon Consort, which is, uh, again, quite useful. And obviously we have the Question Adventure, which is a nice low-cost minion, which can be good but yeah someone said dragon so someone said dragon consort anything else dragon the night is dark and full of terrors the night dark is full of terrors does not tell me which one to choose I, I don't know which one you mean we got dragon someone said cat i i don't know what the cat is caraxi is the great okay <laughs> everyone's saying dragons okay okay i think most people have been saying dragon so we're gonna go for dragon for this one god damn you game of thrones so hopefully we can get some more dragons there. We definitely need to pick more dragons, guys. So next up then, Flying Machine. Tournament Attendee or Oasis Snapjaw. Now, personally, I would go for Flying Machine just because um, that we have a lot of things in the Paladin that can increase attack of stuff. And obviously, he has Wind Fury, so that'd be really cool. No problem, Marcus. Don't worry. You made my day as well. All you guys who come and join always make my day. Like I said, this is more just of a test, but so far it seems to be working. Uh, Snapjaw, Turtle. A lot of people saying it's Snapjaw. Jerome Mormont. I'm guessing this is him. A lot. Of <laughs> two people said. A lot of people saying Jerome Mormont. Guys, guys, come on. Jerome Mormont is the top one at the moment. Okay, let's say we're going. Oh no, Fly Machine is two. I believe me. I know my shit in Arena. I will take your word for that, sir. And you chose Turtle. But, oh, Turtle. You said Turtle before. You can't say Turtle twice. That's cheating. Valeria. Uh, v v Valeria is uh, not a choice. Uh, okay, tournament then. Yeah, people said Jerome Mormont. <laughs> We've gone for Jerome Mormont. Okay, next one then. Spell damage, taunt or adjacent. I would go for the direwolf. I mean, you guys have to pick the direwolf, don't you guys? I mean, look, it's a direwolf. It's a direwolf, guys. Uh, someone asked, uh, Amon, uh, do you like Jeror? I actually really like Jeror Mormont. He's actually, I think he's a really good character. I think his character is well written. I think he's a really interesting person. I know a lot of people don't like him. Yep, yeah, everyone said direwolf. Okay, cat. Yeah, maybe he is a cat. Okay, perfect. Okay, uh, Blood Cell Raider. We don't really have... We have a few weapons, I guess, in Paladin. Could be useful. Um, Dark Iron Dwarf, which is quite a nice one. Four cost, plus one attack this turn. Or an eye for an eye, which I don't think is that useful. I would go for Dark Iron Dwarf. Like I said before, you guys can make it more difficult. As easy for me as possible. Nymeria. We have Dwarf. Okay, someone's saying Dwarf. Nemeth Thomas, you're the guy, you said that you know your shit, so I do trust you. Lady, um, are you saying the lady or do you mean the direwolf lady? Greyjoys, I'm guessing you mean Dark Iron Dwarf. Dark Iron, one of the best four drops in Arena. Dwarf, okay, most people saying Dark Iron Dwarf, and I guess Greyjoy means that as well. Let's go for that. Or maybe that's Eye for an Eye, I don't know. <laughs> okay, next up we have a Berserker. This is quite useful, he gets plus three attack if he takes damage. Always a nice one to have in any deck. <gasps> The Murloc Knight, summon a random Murloc. I never have used this one, and I like that. Uh, captured Jormunga. 
It's a seven cost, but it's not really that good. Um, but yeah, let's see what you guys think. What do you guys think I should have then? Murky, Murlocs, yes, Murloc Knight. He's, look, he's riding a frog. I mean, how can you not choose him? Okay, a lot of people say Murloc Knight, Davos. I'm guessing Murloc Knight is Davos, I'm going to assume. Okay, so most people say Murloc Knight. I think we're going for Murloc. Perfect. Knight has to be Game of Thrones related. Okay, Flying Machine was not a choice there. <laughs> we got Noble Sacrifice. That's always quite a useful one. Um, a nice little uh, secret there. Um, Tinkerton Technician. Plus one, plus one. Mm, we don't really have any mechs. And obviously with the Lord of the Arena. Here's Taunt. I would go for that one. Yeah, if you're having lag, Veal, uh, just make sure you refresh. Um, it should be back to normal. So we have Arena Master, Lord of the Arena. Burn them. I guess you mean Noble Sacrifice, Lord of the Arena. Murloc is the most RP. Sir Pounce. Uh, Sir Pounce is not a choice. Okay, Lord of the Arena, so people are going for it. Let's go for that then. I agree. Okay, next up then. Who should we choose? Should we choose the Antique Heal Bot? We gain extra health. Uh, summon a 1 1 Boar. Or draw a card. I would probably go for Heal Bot. That's what I think. You need high cost buffy minions. Yeah, no, definitely. No, I definitely understand. Like I say, I'm just asking you guys because I really don't care. I, I play this game just for fun. Normally when I play, I basically just make theme decks because that's really how I like to play. Someone's saying heal. Um, that's it, apparently. Or novice. Heal or novice? Ollie. I'm guessing Ollie is novice engineer. <laughs> Razor Fen. Okay, one person went for Razor Fen. Came up a lot of times before. A lot of people saying Ollie. It's a 50 50. Okay, people said Ollie then. Let's go for Novice Engineer. I don't like Novice Engineer. Heal Bot Antique. Okay, well, nope. Looks like some people saying this now. Let's go for that then. Because I agree that that's probably better. Murloc Tidecaller. Now, this could be quite useful because also we already have the Murloc Knight. Um, Game plus one attack. That would be great with the Murloc Knight. Uh, deal one damage all means that sense help these two don't seem so good for us I would definitely go for the Murloc tide caller just because he goes so well with the Murloc Knight But again, like I said, it's your guys decision you guys make this deck for me You can make it easy. You can make it hard. It really depends you go for blade master really huh? I mean deal four damage to himself, but do we have much things to heal him Murloc Murloc 100% you'd go for that Okay, you should have made Murloc arena <laughs> <laughs> Tag caller sounds like a family name. Okay, a lot of people are saying Murloc. Um, fish. Okay, we'll go for that then. I say it's your guys' choice. You guys can make it as easy or as difficult if as you want. Uh, deal two damage to all enemies. That's always a good one. Again, we can have a second draw more months, but I don't think we should. Uh, and spell damage, which is probably not useful for us. And we still don't have any dragons. We still do not have any dragons. But yeah. Okay, what do you guys think then? What do you guys think it should be? Uh, consecration? I agree. Consecration, death. Yeah, that is probably the best one. So two people say consecrate. Three people say four people. Okay, consecration. Perfect. That is definitely the best one. I've always liked consecration. Uh, hey, hey, Captain Leo. Nice to see you. Draw fucking Mormont. Yeah. Jeeves. At the end of each player's turn, the player draws until they have three cards. Now, Jeeves is... He doesn't have much attack and stuff. Arcane Golem is really great to kind of just get in there, um, but obviously he gives the opponent one mana crystal. Or we could go for Taunt. We already have a tournament attendee. I'd probably go for Arcane Golem myself, but we'll see what you guys think then. Uh, Menoth, I don't know what Menoth means. Dummy, someone went for Target Dummy. Um, Jeeves, he's amazing. It depends on the situation, I guess. It depends how much you use. I guess in Arena, she's probably really useful. Jeeves, Dummy, Jeeves. You have no good card draw, good to replace with them. Golem. Okay, Jeeves. People are saying Jeeves. I agree then. Okay, fine. Jeeves. We have a couple of robots. We have like a mix of robots, murlocs, and one dragon. But yeah, okay. Frostwolf Warlord, plus one, plus one for each friendly minion. That could be really useful in a uh, paladin deck, I guess, because obviously we have the uh, silver hand recruits. Plus two attack this turn. That one's quite good, but maybe we, yeah, maybe we could still have one, one, just one. Or a taunt. That is always quite a nice one to have. I I'd like to see what you guys think, though. If you play on a high curve, Jeeves. Okay, look, Menoth up. I don't want to look it up because I don't have time. 
uh, abusive sergeant, uh, frost wolf for late game, wolf, wolf, yeah, I think a lot of people are going for wolf then, frost wolf, okay, it will go to wolf, the carl, <laughs> shield master, I think most people went for frost wolf, we're going to go for him then, okay, next up then we have argent protector, now he gives divine shield, which is always nice, uh, we also have solid, uh, solemn vigil, draw two cards, which is always quite useful, or uh, stealth, what do you guys think then? Mirin Trant, I guess that's the Argent Protector. Carl Drogo, who the hell is Carl Drogo? Is that the Protector? Uh, we have Argent, Argent, yeah, sounds like most people are going for Argent. That's one I always like to have. Okay, definitely Argent, then perfect. Let's go. Okay, River Crocolisk, uh, a two cost one. A spell damage or Ice Rager. We have no free cost at the moment, so uh, Ice Rager might be quite useful. Might be quite useful, but he has low defense. Rural Crocodile is free too. Meh. Depends. Protector, Dire... We've already got a Dire Wolf. Uh, Barristan, Argent Protector, or Roller. That isn't a choice. Rager, Croc. Okay, so we've got a Rager, we've got a Croc. Uh, okay, bye, great steam. Goodbye, Alexandra. Nice to see you. The Carl. I don't know which one's the Carl. Murloc 2015. White Walker, the Ice Rager. Ice Rager is shit, do not. Okay, Croc, Rager, Croc. Definitely between these two. Okay, River Croc. Yeah, Croc. Okay, Crocodile then. People have gone for Crocodile, it seems. Um, Force Tank then. Youthful Brewmaster or Clockwork Gnome. Now, this one's quite good if we have ones maybe have like Battle Cries and stuff. Um, and I... Eh, Frost... No, that won't help him at all. Oh, gain 8 health. That could be quite useful for that. Give 2 minions attack. There's some, uh, give uh, Divine Shield, it could be useful in a couple of situations, but maybe not enough. Tyrion the Kobold, okay, um, tank, okay, someone said tank, clockwork gnome, tank, tank, tank. Yeah, you have no battle that's what I was trying to go for, Kung Fu Panda. Um, but, you know, force tank actually is a good one for a heavy hitter at the end. I think most people said tank at the beginning. Is it does cost eight, which is a lot, but you know, we do need to have a heavy hitter. I think most people went for tank. I don't know what, what you're saying, Tyrion, but I'm assuming you mean gnome. I'm assuming you mean gnome for Tyrion. Okay, most people went for tank at the beginning, so let's go for tank then. Perfect. Let's go then for seal of champions, uh, refreshment vendor. Or Salty Dog. Now, we don't really have pirates. So I'm not sure Salty Dog's really useful. I would probably go for Refreshment Vendor or Seal of Champions. That's the one I would go for. Tyrion Forgering. Yep, there is already a Tyrion. But yeah, what do you guys think? Which one do you want me to choose? What will be in our deck? Have a quick look at what we already have. The Greyjoy, I guess, means pirate. <laughs> Seal. <laughs> Refreshment Vendor, I guess people mean Seal of Champions. Oh no, you mean Seal as in Seal of Champions. Sorry, I thought you meant Seal as in like he looks like a seal. But he's not a seal, obviously he's a walrus. Seal of Champions, it seems. Okay. <laughs> Robert Baratheon, I'm guessing, is Refreshment Vendor. Okay, Seal of Champions. We do need more dragons right now. Um, and the moment we have no dragons. Okay, Guardian of Kings, Clockwork Gnome, or Spider Tank. Now... We probably need some low... I think free is probably a good choice. We don't really have any free ones. And Spider Tank is always okay. But then again, Guardian of Kings restore 6 health. Uh, that's always quite useful. People are saying Sander Clegane, the Hound. Who, who? How are you guys coming up with these things? How are you guys coming up with these names? I do not know. Can you please say who you mean? Okay, we've got Guardian. Someone said King's Guard. I guess he means Guardian of Kings. I'm guessing that means Barris and the Selma. Okay, everyone's saying Guardian. Let's go for Guardian. Again, people want Tyrion, the gnome. But yeah, Grandmaster Pice... What the... Who the hell is Picel? Spider Tank? Okay, Guardian of Kings. I, I saw a lot of Guardians and stuff. It was definitely Guardians. Uh, Divine Shield then for Silvermoon. Muckler's Champion. He did win us a game last time. Or Refreshment Vendor. He has another chance to get in our deck. What do you guys think then? What do you guys think? Varies. Uh, varies is not a choice. Probably in the last ones he was. You need free. Free what? I need free cost maybe, yeah. Spider Tank would have been good for that. 
Everyone's, everyone's going for Muckler. Okay, Muckler, 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 Muckler champ. A lot of people like Muckler. Okay, Muckler, hands down. Everyone's saying Muckler. There we go. Okay, next up then. Hungry Dragon. We have Hungry Dragon. We do need a dragon. Uh, we have Novice Engineer. Or we have Spiteful Smith. Now, we have no weapons right now, so I would say Spiteful Smith is not useful. Novice Engineer. Eh, we two cost. I'd go for I'd go for Hungry Dragon, just because we need some dragons that actually make our bloody dragon consort useful. Yeah, everyone's saying Drogon. Okay, Dracarys. <laughs> you guys are just obsessed with dragons. I I that, that's all I think is going on here. Okay, next up we've got then the Blood Cell Raider again. Weapons: Blood Iron Dwarf or Avenge. I, I've always liked Avenge because uh, Avenge is quite a nice one to have, and we have no secrets at the moment. But Black Iron Dwarf, I mean, we already have one. Maybe having two is good. So, NG, you have to go. No problem, Darth Lannister. No problem at all. Awesome having you here. Have a good night. The Free Heads Prophecy. We need another dragon. Gimu. Avenge or Dwarf? Avenge. Okay, seems like a lot of people saying Avenge then. Avenge. Now it's time to pick Gimli. We've, we've already got one Gimli. I guess the next would be just another Dwarf. I guess Tyrion. Avenge me. Okay, Avenge. Perfect. I would agree for that. Equality, change all minions health to one. I don't think that would be good for us. We don't really have minions with one health, so that's probably going to hurt us more than it would help. Um, Cobalt Guardian, whenever you summon a mech, gain divine shield. Now we do have one, two, three. We do have three mechs, so I mean it's not too bad. Or Taunt. Taunt is a nice one, actually. Taunt is a really good one. Arcane Nullifier. Arcane. So we've got... Okay. Arcane. Equality for Cosette combo. Nullifier. Equality. Whoa. Dip, uh, okay. Cobalt. Equality. A lot of people are going for quality, which surprises me. I think this would be really terrible for us right now. Sander Clegane. Sander Clegane. He's not, he's not any of these. You also had the chance for Spider Tank. I know, yeah. Spider Tank would have gone well. Is this like Yu-Gi-Oh or whatever? I guess it is. You know, it, well, it's not really like Yu-Gi-Oh. King's got King's. I guess Guardian. Have a good night then, uh, Shivang Arya. It's awesome to have you here. Have a good night. It's a little scene you trying to guess what people mean. It is pretty hard. Okay, Arcane again. Okay, it really is. It's kind of even between these. I'm gonna go for Arcane just because I feel like we had. We have hardly any mechs. <laughs> <laughs> the smileys <laughs> the smileys do look really weird actually I do have to admit I do kind of like the smileys um, deal one damage to a random enemy or a youthful brewmaster now battle cries that we do have a few battle cries that could be good or bad but not really enough Do one damage to a random enemy that could be just you know just extra you know cost two two three or I guess the mad bomber is another good one no, free damage though, but between all characters. We've got uh, the Flame, okay, Flame, Kung Fu Panda, Brew, Mad Bomber, Karate Kid. What the? Or Karate, I guess Youthful Brewmaster, Flame Juggler. There's like between Flame Juggler and Panda. A lot of people saying Youthful Brewmaster. I kind of disagree, but you know, you guys are making my deck for me. Okay, Youthful Brewmaster. If you guys make me a bad deck, it's your guys' fault. If I get nothing, it's your guys' fault. Well, and my, the way I play, actually, but yeah. Okay, Solemn Vigil, Harvest Golem, or Loot Hoarder. What do people think? Now, drawing two cards is okay, but it's if we think we're going to have people die. We do have a lot of minions, so there's a good chance we'll get a lot of people die. Um, Harvest Golem, hmm. Again, that would have been a nice mech to have. Um, loot Hoarder, Golem, that's definitely Golem. Harvest, okay, so we got Harvest, hands down, Loot, Golem, Golem, Harvest, Golem, Loot. Oh, Golem, they mean Golem is in Harvest Golem. They don't mean Loot Hoarder. I think like Golem is in from, like, uh, Bloody Lord of the Rings. Okay, Golem. Dragonkin Sorcerer. Now, that is another dragon, but it's not really a dragon that, hel that helps me because we have no buffs at all. That's weird as a paladin. And we have, uh, obviously, Silence. And we have the zombie chow. So yeah, Few, three, three okay choices. Uh, obviously zombie chow is really good at the beginning because he kind of gives you a nice sort of you know, two three for one. That's really nice. 
We've got then, uh, you need the freeze. That's a good point, and we have no freeze right now. So we've got uh, Chow, someone said Chow, someone went Silence. Valerian, I guess Dragonkin. Mas Maester Marwyn, I guess Spellbreaker. Daenerys, what the? Daenerys, are you saying zombie Chow? <laughs> zombie, zombie. Sorcerer, spell, uh, sorcerer. Uh, we have spell, oh, okay, people are definitely split. Okay, a lot of spell breakers at the end then. We'll go for spell breaker. It is good to have some silence in there. Uh, Stormwind Knight, Anoyatron, or Black Wing Corruptor. Now, we do actually have a few dragons, but only a few. Only two dragons, so maybe that's not a good one to go with. I I've always liked Stormwind Knight. I think having the charge 2-5, I've always liked that because it allows them to kind of stay alive, hopefully a bit longer. But, you know, it's down to you guys. Anoyatron is obviously a good general card. You know, he has obviously Taunt and Divine Shield. Wing, he's amazing. But it, we don't have dragons. Anoyatron, Tron. A lot of people are saying Anoyatron. You need early game. Okay, okay, let's go for Anoy then. Everyone's saying Anoyatron. I'd probably gone for Stormwind, but that's me. I'm stupid though. Okay, Cogmaster then. Cogmaster plus two attack for mechs. We do have a few mechs, but do we have enough mechs? That is the question. Uh, Ice Rager or Con Consecration is always good. But do we need two Consecrations? Do you guys think I should have two Consecrations? Or should we go for something else? Consecration, Consecration, Consecration. Uh, I think, yeah, we're going for this then. Sounds like everyone's going for this, I agree. <gasps> Murloc, we have a second Murloc Knight. Oh my god, we'd, we'd be OP, guys. We'd be OP. We'd have two Murloc Knights. I think that's just too OP. Solemn Vigil or Antique Healbot? Now, we already have one Antique Healbot and one Murloc Knight. You always take Borg, Clears, and Arena. Yeah, I agree, actually, yeah. Uh, you can get five Consecrations. That would be pretty good. Uh, so, let's see. Uh, Sig... Sigmister. What the... What the hell is a Sigmister? Um, we've got Knight. So, Knight, Heal... Mercy, Murloc Knight, Murloc Knight, Murloc Okay. Okay, we'll go for Murloc Knight. Okay, guys, calm down. Murloc Knight it is. Uh, restore free health. Another Murloc. Oh, my God. Guys, we have to we have to choose the Murloc. We already have two Murloc Knights. We have the one-cost one. We have to go for Murloc. I think we have to go for Murloc. Guys, what do you think, then? Who should we choose? I would say Puddle Stomper. Because it's a Murloc, you know? There we go, Murlocs. We have to. Heal is a... I, I, I know it's a heal and it's a free, but... We, we have a Murloc here. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to go for Murloc. Just, I want a Murloc. I want to use the Murloc Knights because... I never use the Murloc Knights. So it'd be kind of fun. Okay, we got uh, Enrage them plus free attack. Chillwind, Yeti. Yetis are always, you know, generally quite, you know, just okay. Um, broom, return a friendly minion from the battlefield to your hand. Again, just like the Brewmeister, the cheaper one. Could be useful. I just don't think we have enough Battlecry people, to be honest. No, I don't think we have enough. I think having one Brewmeister is enough. I don't think we want any more than that. We've got one for Chill, Armani, Chinaman. Oh my god. Okay, that's one each right now. I would go for Chillwind. We only have three spots left. Berserker. Okay, Amani and Berserker. Two people have gone for this one. One for this, one for this. I would go for Chillwind. Chillwind Jetty. That's two for that. Amani. You need one more dragon. I pray we get one. Chill, Yeti, Yeti. Okay, Yeti then. Perfect. We've got two more cards we can choose and no sign of any dragons. Spell damage. We literally have no spell damage here. Apart from Consecration, I think we should go for this one. Blessing of Kings. That one's all, you know, plus four, plus four. It costs four. That, that's amazing. Imagine a Murloc Knight with plus four, plus four. I mean, how could you not go for that? So we've got Kings, uh, Nightblade, Blessing, Kings. Okay, definitely looks like the Blessing of Kings. Perfect. And the last one. Again, we got like no like legendaries or we didn't even get any epics. Jesus, that was a terrible randomization. Okay, but let's see. Mind control tech. That one's always a good one if they get more control of the board, but I don't think they will. Uh, Kazan obviously gets a secret. That could be quite useful. People play secrets. Um, or the injured blade mask. 
Injured Blademaster. Now we have a lot of four costs. Maybe three costs would be useful. Maybe one of these. So we got MZT. Okay, everyone, a lot of people are saying this. We got Mystic, MCT, MC Hammer. Okay, MC Tech is the one everyone seems to be going for. Let's go for that in our last one. Perfect. It's a free fuck me. <laughs> I know, but like I said, I'm asking you guys to choose. Um, and we got it, and we got it. You guys actually chose the free cost. It's amazing. We actually did it. We got, we got a few. We got lots of fours, but let's just begin. Let's see what we can do with this deck that you guys have made for me. Hopefully, this can get something done. Hopefully. Jesus. But like I said before, I, I would not call myself a good Hearthstone player. I'd probably say I'm average. Probably just average. I say the best I've done in arena is get 10 wins, but that's that's once, so it's not consistent. You know what, guys? You are the greatest. I think you guys are the greatest people in the world. I'm not even joking. You guys make my day. Okay, we'll get rid of those. They will cost too much. 12 to zero. <laughs> Good luck. Thank you. Okay, there we go. That's much better. So we could fire out the dire wolf, then give it divine shield. Hmm. Consecra consecration. Okay. The most RNG cards. It's pretty fun. That that would be, I guess, really fun. Aye, aye, Captain. Okay, let's see. What is this man? Mimo. Mimo, what have you got, Mimo? Okay, I'm going to go, I think, for Taunt first. Just because I, I would like to put him out and then let him attack. Let's go for this then. We love you, you English bastard. Thank you. Should I put the secret out now? Let's wait a bit. Let's wait a bit for the secret. He probably has some sort of damage thing. Shamans tend to have a few damage stuff. Or yeah, an axe. Don't generally see them have the axe. The elephants will destroy you. What elephants? I mean, we got some damage off, but... Not really what I wanted. What are you going to do? You have nothing. You have no mana. Do, do. Well Greetings. Ah. We don't have many high cost ones, so please... Oh, thank God. Okay, two and two. F you, Mimo. How is that well played? I didn't do anything. Mimo, you, you got you to gotta learn what well played means. I actually didn't do anything. But yeah. Um, okay, so we got terrible stuff. Well, I mean, we got good stuff, but we need. Uh, do you have Mountain Blade Warband? I do have Mount Mountain Blade. Yeah, Mountain Blade Warband. I do love it, but I'm just terrible at it. I'm just terrible at it. Hmm. I'm going for the Puddle Stomper. We don't know if we're going to pick up another, you know, Murloc. Yeah, I do have Mountain Blade, and I do love Mountain Blade. One of the funnest games, I think. But the problem is, is that I'm terrible at it. Play Recruit. I, 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 I would play for Recruit, but just... I want a bit more firepower right now. Consecration, we could get two damage. Hmm. Could be useful. Could play that and get Divine Shield off. That could be useful. He has that damn axe. Huh. Could put out this, and then could just do two damage to all of them. Then he just attack me. Yeah, I think I'm probably going for these two. Put these two out. Give it divine shield, and then hope that he kind of leaves this one alive. And then do consecration, and then destroy this. That's what I'm hoping for. Let's just hope. Let's hope and pray. Um, so sorry about that. I know some people don't like us and I will be playing other things But just for today, I'm just doing a test to see the quality of the stream just to make sure it keeps up to uh, scratch and Basically, I'm just trying to practice trying to talk to you guys interact with you guys. So uh, that's why But yeah, but we're on Sundays my Sunday will be my uh, consistent stream and so on Sundays I'll be basically playing a hmm on Sundays, I'll be playing, uh, what do you call it? I'll be playing probably Game of Thrones mod. Every Sunday, basically. He's giving blood plus one health. Okay, this is bad. 
Now, I could just do Consecration, destroy them all. Probably the best thing to do in this situation. There we go. So we're not doing too bad, actually. He's down to 21 health. Greetings. Greetings, Mimo. Okay, 4-6. Not so good for us. Now, Jeeves, we, yeah, we've still got too many cards right now. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put this guy out. Let's go for that. Because he's only got one out. Let's go for this turn. Let's, let's go for this. I'm going to put the secret. Yeah, you know, let's put the secret. Hmm, should I wait for the secrets? Because he can attack once. He probably can't do anything else. Unless he has some sort of damage thing. But I can put it out now. And if he kills it, it will give him plus... 3 plus 2, which means I could kill him, but then again, 1, 5, I could put that out then and kill him. It probably would work. Hmm. Not sure which one I want to go for there. I just want to keep this one and use it now. Ah, God damn it. I, but don't, don't, I'm not going to do it. I'm going to, I'm going to keep it. I don't think he can get rid of both my men in this turn. We could put out Black Iron Dorf. Then we'll obviously then we could give him possibly the secret. Or to Jeeves. That'd be quite nice as well. Okay, so he's thrown out all his minions now. Because obviously I use Consecration so he probably feels quite confident. I have no, you know, arena destroying things. Probably good I didn't use that. Now he's 5 health. Now I could throw this out plus 2 attack. I don't really see how that would help me. Don't really see how that could help me right now. Plus, you know, free attack couldn't really kill anyone in one turn. We could destroy that. Be quite useful. I think the Yeti is the best thing to throw out right now because it gives us a bit more firepower. Let's go for that. And then we'll bring out another soldier. And I'm just going to go hit him where it hurts. I should have used Avenge then, actually. I should have used Avenge there. Sorry, <laughs> sorry, Nemeth Thomas. It's not I'm not listening to you. I'm just trying to look at what I'm going to do. And also look at the, ta the chat. I, I, I just... I should have used Avenge there. So he's keeping out my... Uh, my shield. Uh, my chill wind. Come on, please get some good. Okay, plus one health. That's not... That's pretty good. He's going to get Overload, but he gets two cards. Damn it. That could be good then to put Jeeves out now, then. Could be a good time to throw our Jeeves out. Now I give plus four, plus four. Aha. Bullshit. Uh, not bullshit. I am, I am trying to look at this and the chat. It's kind of difficult. That's what, that's what I'm trying to do is practice, because I want to try and practice doing streaming. I could throw that out. Uh, so you're saying to use that. I could throw that out, but plus six. He's going to destroy this next turn with that, I'm guessing. I could throw out plus four, plus four to this. And there's also a lag for some. Yeah. Could do that. And I could throw that out. Yeah, let's go for that. Yeah, let's go for that. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to throw this on top of him, just to make him unstoppable. And we can get one extra card. Eh. Um, how about that we could attack him or we could attack one of these. Now who do I want to attack? Five, they can do nine damage worth. So I'm going to go for this because he'll probably attack me. So I just, want to, I just want to damage him so I can get him down health. But yeah, we'll see. Okay, Frostwolf is not so helpful. He's got plus. He's got about five health, plus three attack. God damn it! Okay, that's not going to help us. Frog next turn. We do not have a frog, and now he's going to plus. Oh god damn it! At least we kill it. I am not doing good, Rabbit King. <laughs> that is the opposite. He's got complete control of the board right now. If I had consecration. God damn it. How did, 
How the hell, Dayak? You said frog next turn. How the hell did you know? You're you're like a sorcerer. How did you know? You're, you're like you're like I, I I don't even know what to say. I I want to use it. Um. Because we need to get stuff on the board, so we use this. We use uh, this, I guess. And we get a random Murloc. Oh! Okay, whenever a friendly Murloc dies, draw a card. Okay, 2-5. Not too bad. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw this out. We need to do something. He's a witch. Burn the witch! Dayak, I'm sorry. We're going to have to burn you. Um, you made... You were able to tell the future, so we're going to have to kill you. That, that's just how things work. So luckily he killed off that first. And so that's gone off to our uh, spirit walker. Excellent. Excellent. Yet from now on, Dayak, you are now known as the Red Priest. Everyone remember that. Whenever Dayak is in the stream, he is our Red Priest. You are Melisandre. He still has nine mana. What is he going to do? Gotta play some overload things. Okay, well, that is bad. Okay, that's bad because he has these two here, which have effects based upon having more health. But now he's dead. And luckily, the Murloc Knight is still alive. Our precious Murloc Knight is still alive. <laughs> Alexandra, hello, welcome back. Um, glad to have you on board. Now we could go for this, give him plus five, we could destroy that, or we could destroy that. So that, then we do this, but then, uh Stanny the Manny. What should I do? Could throw this out, get, we could throw this, and then throw this. That would be really useful, actually, we get a really strong one. Throw this out, and then do it, then go plus one. Yeah. I think we should go for this. I, I, I want to go for this. But first we do this, obviously. Let's get another Murloc. Murloc me. And we got, we got the same one. Excellent. Okay, and we'll go for this. There we go, 8-8. Eight, eight. Um, he just free damage. Now, I, I should damage him. Because if I damage him, he has to kill this. Let's go for that then. Okay, if he, I'm going to go attack him because he has to kill me then. He has to attack this. I, I literally at the moment I don't know what I'm doing. Um, normally when I play, I, I I feel like I do better. I feel like I'm doing worse at the moment because I'm trying to read the chat and do this, and this is having a big effect actually. Okay, this is bad. So we actually attacked him, which is actually quite good because obviously. Damn it, that damn Stormwind, that Stormwind champ has actually made this ridiculous. The smileys, I actually really like the smileys. I think they look really like horrible, but in a cute way. They're like really horrible, but like you're kind of like, oh, that's kind of cute. Oh, is he going to kill him? Come on. you got to kill him, haven't you? Ah, oh, there you go. I was just about to say, I was going to say, he's going to have to kill him or I win. If we could get past these two, we, we could win. But I don't think we can. Okay, heal myself. So we could throw out these two, give us a plus attack. That's not really going to help, is it? Now, he wants me to attack that one. So I can destroy this. 12, 12. That's 12, 18, 21. Yeah, he'll kill me if I don't kill that. He's going to kill me if I don't do that. He's got six attacks. So throwing this out and doing this won't help me. I'm just going to have to try. Yeah, let's throw this out. I have to get... Oh, this is ridiculous. I have to kill that. He has six attack, though, so I, I, it's not going to help me. Let me think. Could throw this out. Could throw this out. Not really much difference. I'm going to go for this, then. We need extra health. Plus eight health. And then I think we should go for Mukla. For now. And we'll go attack him. You know, they're, they're kind of even. We're so close. He only has 8 health. And heal Mukla. Ah. Mukla. And heal and... So you mean heal and Ukla. So that's basically what I did. I say, uh, Nemeth, I, I am definitely reading your comments, but your comments come in after I've done stuff, because there's a lag between you guys and also what I'm doing. But damn it, he's getting all these taunt things. 
And with the Stormwind, I'm just unable to get into attack. Can you put a little power to it? Yay, the Murloc Knight, everyone's favorite. I'm going to throw this out because we just need hands on deck. Oh, is that just going to kill us? Come on, Murloc Knight, give us something good. Okay, Puddle Stomper, it could be worse, but that damn Stormwind. Ah. Damn you, Stormwind. I hate... I actually, I like Stormwind, but he's bloody just... Screw me over. To be honest, I have to admit, I think in the two arenas we've done, we've kind of been screwed over in the selections, actually. Like, we've had no, like, storm wins. We've had no, like, legendaries or epics, really. Pretty bad choices. Can he kill me? He can kill me. Well, there we go. Oh, there we go. There wasn't really anything I could do about that. <laughs> Paladin lost. Yeah, I am dead. <laughs> okay. Let's let's try let's try again then. We have some we have some other tries, you know, guys. You can't win them all, or as I sometimes say, you can't lose them all, can you? We're gonna try though. We're gonna try and lose them all. <laughs> yeah, but this this is what this has basically told me is I feel like uh, on my channel, definitely Hearthstone is definitely not so much probably putting on my channel. <laughs> it definitely does not seem to be something that people really want to watch on my channel. Partly, I mean, there's definitely less viewers in it than if I did CK2. If I did CK2 Game of Friends, there'd be so many people in here. No problem, Veal. It's always good to have you here. Thank you very much. The elephants have destroyed you. I, I'm still very confused about what elephants. Now, I don't think at the beginning that would be good. Let's go for that. Okay, that's pretty good. One, two, three. That's perfect. There we, we exactly know what we're going to do then. Let's go. For, oh, shit. But. Hello. He's just going to destroy it with the fire blast. So there's literally no point in sending it. I'm not going to send it out. But don't worry, guys. If, like I said, I am going to do CK2 on Sunday. Definitely. This is more of a practice. There's no point in sending them out because it was a bit destroyed. Yeah. And luckily. I, why well played? Why do people do that? I did not play well at all. It was just random. Jesus, I don't think people know how this game works. Let's go for the croc. Hopefully the croc will be good. Whenever you want a small council for CK2 stuff, just play it as hard. <laughs> okay, that's, that's a good point. Now, I'm always going to do a small council, even when there's lots of people, just because it's more fun. Let's throw this out then. Now, okay. I'm probably going to destroy that because you can attack me if you want. If I destroyed that, you can attack with that. Let's go for that then. Everyone, you, you guys are saying Golem and Harvest. I've already done it. <laughs> like I said, you know, I'm going to have done this stuff before you could even see. Generally, the way I like to, I like to clear the board. That's generally how I like to play. My style is kind of, I like to gain control of the board. That's normally what I like to do. If I can, obviously. Ah, well, there we go. That's made it a bit more interesting. We can destroy both of my minions, but obviously we get that. Then he's going to use that, and he destroys it, of course. Okay, so we can send the Merlot. Oh, okay. I think, yeah, the Nullify is the best choice. Let's go for Nullify. I think that's the best choice for us right now. The others all have, like, Battle Cries and stuff, which we want to use in the future. Let's go for this, then. Wait for my council? I would wait for the council, but the thing is, is that if I wait for the council, then it means I have less time to do stuff. And you guys might all disagree. I said the council stuff was more for kind of uh, choosing what my deck would be, rather than actually choosing what, how to play. Small council are as horny as Pycelle. You are correct. Whenever we do the small council stuff, people just tell me to uh, do it with everyone. But yeah. I'm going to go for Hungry Dragon. Just because. I'm going to go for that. Ah, it's a pig. Excellent. I'm actually going to kill this because that's actually 
less of a problem. So I'm going to kill this. And I'm actually going to throw out, I think, this. Just because that means he might waste his fireball on it. So I'm going to throw this out. Yeah, just to do that. Or he'll waste this on that. So basically he'll waste something, hopefully. Or rain, or rain waters as the pirate king. That actually would be quite a fun uh, small council actually if I do all rain waters. But like I say at the moment I'm thinking about doing a... Who was I thinking about doing? A Jon Snow is my preferred choice at the moment. I think a lot of people like him. But we'll see. Oh, so he, he's destroyed him. But I still have my hungry dragon. So that's good. I have the power. I have the power. And we could do consecration which would destroy it all. But... I kind of want to, because it just it would clear the board. It doesn't have many cards, yeah, and I won't have to worry. Yeah, I'm going to do that, just because I don't have to worry about the board. I have other minions to do, and we'll, we'll get a nice little uh, silver ham recruit, and we'll deal five damage. We need to start dealing damage to him. The mages are always kind of annoying because uh, I'm glad everyone's agreeing. Everyone's now saying consecration, <laughs> please. I, I did it. Don't worry. Don't worry, Nemeth, I did it. But, I did it before you did it. But great minds think alike, you know, they say. Sadly, I'm not a great mind. And give your demons... Are you... Uh, give your opponent a mana crystal. Ooh, can I do that to him then? That's actually a good... Actually, that would not be too bad. Huh. That may not be too bad. I, I hate that one. But yeah, he's put down a secret. Free, free. That could mean anything. So I'm going to attack him. Kind of see what it is. Nope, apparently it's probably something I'm going to... If I kill him, it's probably like he gets two. Or if I put something down. So I put down something that's weak. Yeah, I can't even give... Oh, I can't give it to anything, actually. Wow, okay, that's completely useless to me, then. Okay. I could attack him, then, and then heal my... I could heal him. Put the Murloc down, get some more men... That could be useful. How about we, we attack it, see what happens. Let's go for that. Probably gets two. There we go. He's going to get two of them. Oh, the same cost. Are you kidding me? Okay, he's going to get that. Uh, I am going to... Do this. And then summon this. That's probably about... I should have healed this, but, you know... We'll see. Ooh... Has plus one attack for each other Murloc on the battlefield. Now he has charge, which I could have used if I'd have known. Don't worry, Lemon, I, it's not for everyone. Now this is this is kind of for people who like this game. I'm just trying something different. Okay, yeah, thought he would do that. Probably should have thought more about that. Now I could obviously do the silence, so get him down to 4-4, four, four, which would be much more I could then attack with that and attack with that. I could just give plus two attack, actually, um, as well. We could do both, actually. Okay, how about we silence him? Yeah, I know I had charge, but I, I didn't see it until I, I we had so little time. And I'll do this. I'm going to for each other Murloc. We could do that and get another Murloc. I mean, yeah, okay, we'll do that. We'll get another Murloc as well. Perfect. Excellent. Who do we get? There we go. Plus four attack. There we go. That worked out quite well. See, the Murloc Knight is just overpowered. The Murloc Knight is so overpowered. You guys, you know... You guys are just overpowered. NG, I don't like this game. <laughs> no, no worries, guys. Like I said, I understand. I know a lot of people don't like this game. And obviously, a lot of you are on my channel for Game of Thrones. Uh, and Seeker 2 and other Paradox types of games. But yeah, just the point was is that I want to try something different. Because I, I just enjoy playing this game. It's just kind of a test. Now we could easily destroy this. Plus 3 attack and Divine Shield. Yeah, we could just do that for someone. Or just plus 2 attack to... Puddle Stomper, I guess. Even if I do this, then I, I lose them. So let's, let's get someone killed, yeah. Let's get someone killed, I think. Throw him out. Puddle Stomper. Oh! Some a copy. Well, okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad, guys. That's not terrible. Um, he has four health, so we could just give it to this. Then he'll just kill it with a fireball, won't he? There's no point doing that. 
I, how about I give it to you? How about I let you die, then I can summon a new thing, we get a new Murloc as well. There we go. Let's do that. Okay, everyone, quickly attack. Quickly, go, go, go. No, 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 no. Quickly, go. Go, go, guys. Go, my men. Okay, there we go. Phew, that was close. <laughs> Never sacrifice the Murloc. Of course not. The Murloc Knight, as we all know, is overpowered. He's so overpowered. A war, a warm lock. Okay. I oh, destroyed him. My poor, my poor Morlocks. He should have probably put that down. Oh, and he's let us win. Excellent. In your face, Horace. You suck. But yeah, like I said, like I said this game is not for everyone. Rest in peace, Puddle Stomper. I know Puddle Stomper sacrificed himself for the greater good. He sacrificed himself for the greater good. It is known. Puddle Stomper was a great Murklock. It is known. Hey, uh, Duyuk, Yuri, do you have any more uh, sort of uh, see things you've seen in the future happen? That'd be quite nice. Murloc, Warlock. Do you know what? It's interesting though. I've actually never thought of a Murloc, Warlock. I've never actually seen that either. I love Warlock, a Warlock. I love Murlocs, but I've never tried one of that. I'll check it out, I'll check it out, but I don't really have enough Warlocks, I don't think. Like I say, I've not really been playing this for long. I've been playing this for maybe the last two months, maybe? So, I, I don't feel like I have enough cards. I've been trying not to buy cards, I've basically just been getting things for free. Except for, I bought the Adventures. And that was really not a good selection. But luckily, you know, we, we have recruits. We have recruits, you know. We can always get two. It's not too bad. Should I link it? Um, no, don't worry, Thomas. I, I'll, I'll find it. I'll keep it in mind, because I do like Warlock, actually. Usually I make, like, a demon deck, just because I happen to have the uh, Malganis, whatever you call him. Malganis? So I, I kind of usually like to try and make a demon deck, just because, you know, it's one of the few uh, legends I have. But, yeah. Actually, I think it was the... No, it was, it was the second legend I opened... The first legend I opened was uh, the Goblin Pirate, you know, plus one, plus one to one of your weapons. So I, I kind of made weapon decks because of that, but yeah. Uh, you going to do anything, Gambetti? Okay, he's got Taunt. Now, I'm going to say go for the Dire Wolf because he has plus, you know, one attack and we can just destroy him. We can give him Divine Shield, but that's not, yeah, probably want that later. We could throw the Harvest Golem out, but then what do we do? Yeah, let's go for that. The there we go, perfect, done. The priest shall die, we shall burn him. He's a heretic, he believes in the faith of the seven. And the seven gods. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, there's only one true god and we all know he's Roller. He's Roller. Ah, but actually, that actually makes complete sense because Murlocs, obviously, because they're so cheap, you, you kind of just play them all and they run out. That actually makes sense, Nemeth. I actually like that. I, that's actually a really nice idea. Okay, so we've got the Murloc Knight again. So obviously, we, we want to play the Murloc Knight. He'll win us the game, of course. I um, don't want to play that. We could give him the Seal of Champions. Nullifier, we give him plus one attack. That means he can destroy him if he attacks with him. I think that is probably the best choice because we don't want him to destroy this and that's what we do. So I would use the Seal of Champions or we use the Nullifier and I'm going to go with Nullifier. And we'll leave it at that. So Trafonka, small council, I require your help. Should I eat the crunchy granola bar or the soft one? The crunchy is peanut butter and the soft one's fruit and nut. Hmm, I would go for the crunchy one, to be honest, Trafonkus. Fruit and nut, nah, nah, I don't know. For me, you know, fruits and nuts together, not my kind of thing. That's if I was eating. And I think most people agree. Are you allergic to peanut butter and what kind of fruit? That, you know what, Rabbit King, you are asking the true questions right there. You are asking the real questions. I think you're man of the match, to be honest. 
Because you're asking those good questions, I'm going to declare you as my master of laws. Peanut, probably. Ah, oh, damn it, he's going plus four. That's not going to help him, though. He still can't kill him, and I can still kill him. But he can still cause a lot of damage. Or is he just going to do nothing? He's going to take a while to choose. Threat him. You hear that, priest? Justice demands retribution. Are you going to attack? Go on, go on, attack. Ah, oh, he, he wussed out. What a wuss. What a wuss. How, how dare he? Ah, Muckler. I think Muckler is a good choice. Now, I, I definitely think we should just attack this, to be honest. I think we should just attack that. Um, two Murloc Knights. But they cost four, we have five. We want to wait till next turn, then we can play them and play uh, one of these. That's probably the best choice. Now, Harvest Golem, three, then we can have two. Yeah, let's go for the Muckler. I think we should go for Muckler. So then when we throw down the Murloc Knight and we use Inspire, it'll work for both of them. So we'll have Murloc Knight inspired as well. It'll be perfect. <laughs> There we go. Murloc and next turn Murloc and recruits. We could have. Oh, I could, yeah, I could have done two. I, I think this one's better though. I think having Muckler's better because he kind of then boosts everyone. And if I have two Murlocs out, that means I'm spawning three things every turn, and we probably can't fit that in. But likely he'll probably go to attack him. But what else does he have? Okay, he's going to attack him. He has one health. But what will he do next? Ah, he's going to heal him, obviously. Of course he is. Ooh, okay, that's actually... That that was a pretty good move, actually. That caused me a bit of damage. Okay, well, let's go then for the Murloc Knight. And... Hmm. Yeah, I think the Murloc Knight's the best choice right now. Now, I'm assuming that will activate before the Murloc Knight. I'm going to assume, but we'll see. Activate after, please. Nah, he activates first because he was placed down first, I guess. But he gets it, which is kind of cool. Um, all of the Murlocs get plus one attack. Oh my god, look at that. Our Murloc Knight is a monster. Now, the question is, do I kill him with him or do I keep him? I think I'm going to kill him just because we need to get rid of that because he'll kill our Murloc. I could attack that now. We, we want to kill him because our Murloc could be killed. Let's go for him. Could I do a House Hightower campaign next in Aegon's Conquest? That is a possibility. I have not done a Hightower Let's Play. That could be kind of a fun one for when I do the live stream, actually. And he's going to heal himself, obviously. Of course he's going to heal himself. I mean, uh, it's a priest. He gets an extra card. Okay, now we don't need the Brewmeister. Uh, Puddle Stomper, we could put the Alpha Murloc Knight down. But then again, how are we going to kill that? I could give the plus three. That's the thing. How about. I put that out. How about we. <clears throat> you know what? I'm just going to do this. And this and Puddle Stomper. That's what I think I'm going to do. Yeah, because I, I want to get rid of that. Because that is such a problem. And we'll see what we get here. We got, we got a Puddle Stomper. Excellent. That's, that's just, what I, just what I needed. Great. Perfect. Thank you so much. Actually, you know what? Actually, you know what? I'm going to give Divine Shield to my Murloc Knight. And then we're going to destroy this because that is just going to get in our way. He doesn't get hurt. And then we have attack. We'll go to attack him directly because if I attack him, he'll just heal him. Okay, uh, Trafonkus. NG, my king, I've taken it upon myself to write down the positions in your council and who fills them. Um, okay, interesting. I don't really have any positions to be honest right now. And I think there's too many people who will watch my stream sometimes. I mean, last time I did the stream, we had like over 100 people. 
I don't think we could give everyone... Oh, okay, he's going for the Cobra. That makes me think he can't kill this, which is good. Yeah, he's going to attack him and he will... Oh, he'll heal him now. But next time we can kill it, we can use the Puddle Stomper. If I put this out, yeah, we have too many. We're just going to have too many. We'll, we'll put out the Murloc Knight when he dies. Now, this is only when he has four or more minions, so he hasn't almost enough. I'm just going to throw this out, so we get one more. We get Spawn one. Yeah, if I put this down, we would have too many. Guys, I'm back. Glad to have you back, Nemeth. Oh, excellent. We'll never, never met for, for any Murloc dies. Excellent. Yeah, we can get these killed then. Excellent. <laughs> I can attack him. I can attack him. <clears throat> but then we can't. I could can then just kill it with that. Yeah, okay, let's try that. Let's draw cards. Puddle Stompers, sacrifice yourselves for the good of the realm. And then let's see if I can get anything else to improve attack. We can't have anything to improve attack, so let's just uh, let's just kill that. Because I just want to get rid of his stuff on the board. Okay, now what do I want? I'll put you out for good measure. Yeah, let's put him out. I could put out the, the Murloc Knight, but like I said, if I put the Murloc Knight, we'll just have too many things popping up. You took a piss and filled the blackfish. Shit already hit the fan. Yes. I'm master of laws. You are a rabbit king. O only for this stream, though. Only for this stream, not forever. And uh, Dayak Uriel is the red priest. So, you know, I, I guess we're making kind of a small council right now. I'm just hoping he can't kill our Merlock Knight. I want to attack him. Ah, use the hero power twice. Huh. Ah, Wind Fury. Okay, so he's not going to do anything else. So all we got to do is kill her. Which we will do. And we have Consecration. So that'll put it down to... Oh, that's perfect then. Yep, I think we should go for Consecration. Because I just want to just get rid of his knight. I want to just hurt him. There we go. I uh, will also bring out one of these. And we get a new Murloc. We got a say we got another one. Okay. Whenever another one dies. Okay, well, I can sacrifice you. Cause I don't care. Um we could sacrifice you into him. Yeah, how about you go into him? And we'll we'll fight you into him, you survive. And we'll go and attack with seven attack. I think we'll probably win this one actually. And then we have three left. We won't use anything else. So we got we got a good hand here. We've got lots of cards to use. Your assistant to the regional manager. Um, Eamon, that is not a position on the small council. That is a position in a, a store or something. Captain of the City Watch, nothing could go wrong. <laughs> um, Rabbit King, you cannot hold two positions. That's just too much. All the lands, yeah, all the lands belong to me. This is actually a communist government. Uh, this is actually a communist king. Just so you guys know. Oh, he's going to destroy the Murloc Knight. But he does not know we have a second Murloc Knight. <laughs> oh, there we go. Look at that. That is working out perfectly. This is working out too well. I have too many cards. I think we've won this. To be honest. Master of Ships. No. No, no, no. Okay. I'm going to throw out the Murloc Knight. <laughs> Just because the Murloc Knight is so overpowered. No, uh, Nemeth, you cannot be Hand. No. Hand has to be something... You have to do something extraordinary to become Hand. We'll throw out this because, you know, we can call upon some more. Um, hmm. I guess we might as well throw this on you. Just because you get more attack out of him. There we go. Our Murlocs have won the day. I say we have a rebellion. Aim on a... Don't rebel. That is silly. That is silly. Can I be the Murloc King's Guard? Ah, oh, yeah, I can have a King's Guard. I thought I was your Davos. Uh, hmm. Okay, Nemo. For this stream, for just this stream, you are my Hand of the King. Okay. 
Trefuncus, you are the master of coin because you've been writing down who everyone is. So I guess you're you, you're kind of good at keeping track of things. So you can be master of coin. If I notice you in the chat a lot, I will give you guys positions. Basically, <laughs> that's how it goes. If I notice you in the chat a lot, you're helping me a lot, you're, and you're just good people. Of course, I'm going to give you a position on my council. I will fight with honor. Uh, okay, Murloc. I want to keep the Murloc Knight out. How about we get rid of Avenge and that? Let's keep these two. Uh, let's keep these Murlocs out. The Murlocs so far have won it for us. No, no, uh, Rabbit King. You're not the king of the rabbits. I'm the only king. I am the only king. Hey, Isaac Greystock. Awesome to have you here. I know it's not what I normally stream, but you know what? It's just something for fun, something I'm playing, just so we can kind of get more used to streaming. Still kind of learning. But so far, we're doing quite well. Two wins to uh, one loss, I think it is. Master of the Peasants. That is what... I think people call that a rebellion. I think that's what people call the rebellion. But yeah. So I could just throw out uh, the coin just to get out the Puddle Stomper. You know what, but I'm not going to. I think we have enough cards where we're fine. I want to get out to the Murloc Knight. Look at that frog. I mean, how can you how can you hate the Murlocs? I mean, look at that frog. He's so cute. Oh, he's such a cute frog. Interesting. So we have tournament attendee. I think this time we're going to throw him out because I have nothing that I really want with a battle cry apart from him. But yeah, it's not like he's going to have four things twice. So I was going to get him out there. We'd have to then use his uh, things just a free two. Killer boy wants to be master of sex. I think that's what people call a prostitute. Um, if you want to be a prostitute, you can be a prostitute. The king doesn't need to provide people with uh, the situation as prostitute. Also, there's no master of war as well. Um, puddle, I don't want Puddle Sumpa to die, though. So I guess we put this out. Let's go with that. And let's go for this. Yeah, I don't want Puddle Stomper to die. And I want to get rid of his uh, Divine Shield. Rebellion, Kingswood Brotherhood. <laughs> Good going, them. That my hand of the king is dealing with the rebellions, I think. Oh, damn it! And it's like he got it. Very upsetting. And he didn't attack, but that means I can attack this turn. So I can get rid of that. I can do consecration. So we can kind of go get rid of everyone. But yeah. For the horde. But yeah. Consecration could be useful. Just because we need to get rid of that. And anything else I do is not really going to be that helpful. So uh, let's go for consecration. Let's clear the board. We have another consecration, so it's fine. Master of that one thing. You, Alex, K, Alex K, you could be master of the 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 chair in the corner where the you know where Tommen sits. That's what you could be in charge of. Congratulations. You've had a you've had an uh, a promotion. But okay, next up. Okay, four four. Murloc Knight. Now, I don't want to put my Murloc Knight out next. Let's put him out. Now, I could go for this, get a free. Just put him out. Let's go for that. I want to put the Puddle Stomper out with the Murloc Knight. Thanks, Isaac Greystock. I I'm, I'm really glad you enjoy the channel. That's all I really want. The fact people just enjoy it is really just makes me really enjoy it. Should be Polly Stomp Tide Caller. <laughs> okay. Normally I just call my custom characters Parry Docs. Just because it kind of goes with my name. But yeah. Everyone wants to be everyone in my court. I can't just be giving out, you know, these titles willy nilly. You know, that's just. That's, that's just ridiculous. Uh, if you want to be the leader of the company of cats, you don't need to ask. Uh, you can just go make it. That's, that's literally how it works. 
Okay, here we go. We got the taunt here. That could be quite useful. He's hitting us quite hard at the moment. I could give him plus two attack. Attack him. That could be useful as well. That could be useful. How about we go for that then? Yeah, I'm going to go for that. Because then he just dies and becomes a 2-1. Uh, Which isn't too bad. And we'll go for this. Throw out the Puddle Stomper. There we go. I had a massive lag. Yeah, if you do have a massive lag, make sure you do refresh. That can happen. <laughs> okay. Apparently, we, apparently we've got a prostitute in the, uh, in, the, in the chat section, apparently, at the moment. To be honest, whenever I play CK2, I never choose a cupbearer. Just because I never trust the cupbearer, which sounds really silly. Okay, that was a good shot. That was a good shot. Luckily, he did not kill our Puddle Stomper. No, Puddle Stomper! No! Okay, so he's he's got a good one there. That was, that was a good thing he did there. I guess he probably should go for the Taunt. Or go for the Murloc. Because he can't kill our Murloc. Can he? He can't kill a Murloc. Of course not. It's impossible. Let's go for that. Let's get an army. Summon him never more luck. There we go. And he has... Awesome. Perfect. Charge. And that's it. Okay. <laughs> I wish I wasn't shit at this game. Don't worry, you know, I I'm also shit at this game. I think lots of people are. I don't think it's a rare thing to find, actually. No, no, please. No! A Murloc Knight. A Murloc Knight has died. I'm so sad. It's a sad day for everyone. We should have a day of mourning, I think. Uh, can I give out King NG? No, if you can give out no titles. You can't just give out titles. That's ridiculous. Uh, we should probably put this out to get health back. Because he has no real hard hitting stuff. So it's probably the best thing to do. Let's go for that. And hopefully they put out a lot of stuff. Then we can use the mind control tech. I'm just gonna throw this out because, yeah, we can get we just call more things right now. We'll attack him, bring it down a bit. There we go, perfect. Yep, someone was telling me the heal. Dayuk, again, you saw the future. I'm not sure how you're doing this. It's time we mourn, of course, Killer Bow. Everyone mourn for our uh, Murloc Knight Kingsguard. The first one to die. Okay, so now he's got his... Oh, yes, yeah, so perfect. Now I can use our mind control tech. No, 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 no! Oh, God damn it! <laughs> so we can definitely kill this. But there's two other ones out. Which could be a problem. So I could throw out our Lord of the Arena. Then I put this onto him. We destroy that. And we attack. I guess is probably the best thing to do. Or I could silence him, making him a 4-4, four, four, which could be actually good as well. 4-4. Four, four. Then we could throw out our own Frost Wolf. There's actually some good choices there, aren't there? There's actually some good choices. You know what? I'm going to silence him to bring him down. Yeah, we can save this for later. That's a really useful thing to have. And hopefully then he puts some more stuff out. Now I'm going to put out this. He died a hero. He did, Aaron. That Murloc Knight died a damn hero. And you guys will remember that forever. Forever, I say. Oh, we'll just kill him. He'll probably just kill him with uh, the Oasis Snap Jaw. But you know what? That's still pretty good. He's run out of cards as well. So we, we definitely got him on the, the edge. Aaron, you know what? For your... For your uh, what do you call it? Uh... For your sense of dignity towards that uh, Myalurk Knight, you've been named part of the first member of the Myalurk King's Guard. Congratulations. Congratulations, Aaron. Have you watched Vikings? I have actually not watched Vikings. I have never seen it. He's probably going to try and kill this, I would think. 
Because I don't think he can kill me. If he can throw, throw one more minion down. Go on. Throw one more down. Come on. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. He's killing me anyway. He gets a slime. And it does not double up. Okay, yeah. You definitely want to kill that. Not really surprised. We'll push it going to attack. There we go. I can probably kill that next. Probably use the Seal of Champions to do it. Ah, oh, damn it. Almost had a chance where he had four outs. But now he's used up all his cards. So I'm in a great position. And obviously we can use this, this, that'd be eight. And we can't use all of them. So I'm saying we use that, and then we use that for this. Yeah, five, one, yeah, perfect. I think that'd be best. He's only got one. I'm gonna go for this. I'm gonna give this guy this, cause then, you know, just to give him more attack. Kill this. The next turn, hopefully, he survives, and we can then do seven damage. And we can throw out this Annoyatron. I shall serve loyally, Your Grace. Thank you, Aaron. Thank you, Aaron. The Frog Knight, yes. You're known as the Frog Knight. Only for the stream, not, not for future. Ah, oh, free web spinners. I've never seen someone use Bull of Spiders before. Actually, it's the first time I've seen someone use that. I think I'm probably going to win this at the moment. Now, these could cause a problem, but also I'm not going to kill them. So I'm going to go and do 13 damage. I'll throw this out. That's going to cause problems for him. We have this now. So I'm going to throw this out, get one of his minions. We get one of these. Excellent. Okay, great. We'll throw this down. And I guess we throw down the Dragon Consorts just to kind of show him that, you know, we mean business. We mean business. And, yep, yeah, next turn I've won. Yeah, we're doing pretty well actually now. I think, to be honest, it's the Murloc Knights. The Murloc Knights are actually better than I thought. He's going to kill him now. He's got to attack with both of these and he still won't be able to kill him. But then again, he gets cards back into his hand and obviously he has 10 mana. He could still have a chance, but unless he kills these two, I've won. What you got? What you got, Naysayer? Naysayer, I guess. You could say it's Naysayer. All hail King Aaron. <laughs> Thank you, Aaron, for staying a law. Remember the king's guard. Oh, he's giving him... Ah, sneaky. But I still win. So... Sorry, I guess. Sorry about this. I'm going to kill you, but... Um, yeah, here we go. He's dead. And we'll finish you with the Dragon Concert. Excellent. Would you name a Valyrian... What would you name a Valyrian Steel Sword? Oh my god, that's a, that a horrible question to ask because that's such a difficult question that I don't even know how I'd answer that. I literally have no idea how to answer that question. That's actually a really tough question. What would I name a Valerian Steel Sword? Probably something like Paradox. No, I'm joking. Um, Caraxis. <laughs> Caraxis. Fashbinder. Fash <laughs> Fashbinder is always great. I literally, I actually can't think of anything that I would name it. I don't know. It really depends on the situation, I feel. I don't know. I, uh, so you've upset me now with that question. Because I can't uh, name it. But yeah. Frostbite me personally. Dragon fairy fart. What? What? <laughs> Give you a house name. How about Murloc? Murloc's, you know, honourable. It's a good name. Glamdrin. <laughs> okay. You guys have chosen some Soul Reaver. GG. GG. So, so far, actually, you guys made a good deck, actually. Sex Queen, apparently. Well, let, let's throw down this, just because I don't want to throw this down after the Annoyatron, because it goes back into my hand, which would be very stupid. I mean, it would have been really good with the uh, Antique Heal Bot, I guess. Yeah, I probably should have waited, actually. But, oh well, it gives us free attack. I want to get in there and hurt him. Stupid priests. What are you going to play? Potato Cannon, what are you going to play? Ah, he's, he's gone for the uh, Bone Guard Lieutenant. 
Interesting choice, sir. Interesting choice. Let's go for this. NG of House Murloc, first of his name. I could just go and destroy him. So if he uses that to heal that, he gives plus one health. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm going to kill him. Against Priest, I feel like you've got to clean the board because if the Priest gets out lots of minions, then he has too many minions, he can just heal them and stuff, and it's really difficult to get him out of the way. You know what, guys? This stream is one of the best ones out there. Really? This is a terrible stream. <laughs> to be honest, I, I would not say this is a particularly good stream. I would definitely I think that my Seeker 2 ones are better just because... It's really interactive and it's just kind of really just randomly fun and the chat is absolutely hilarious sometimes on that. So I always really enjoy that. I guess we give the minion plus four plus four. Attack that because of our divine shield. Could be quite useful. Um, good. Uh, see you then, Amon. It's awesome to have you here. Okay, plus two attack. That does not help. Or we could silence. That doesn't help either. Yes, I guess this is actually the best thing to do. With an overpowered one. Thank you, that's really nice to hear, Nemeth. I'm really glad you enjoy. It's good, don't worry. Thank you. <laughs> as long as it's okay to be honest, like I say, this is not really my main my main series. This this series, this stream is just something I'm doing extra. Just because I like to play this game, really. So we can kill him and would stay alive. Oh, I could just silence him, but that doesn't really help, does it? Plus two attack doesn't help us either. Okay, how about we just destroy him? I want to get rid of it because, like I said, the priest is just kind of frustrating. I could heal him because he has like five extra health, but I like to heal myself. I think that's more important. How about we go for this and then we'll go for this. So next turn then we have a load of things, unless he does like a, he has that wave, whatever you call it, just two damage. Silence. What? NG. He said Sunday. Rabbit. Uh, Nemeth, why are you saying what? Is it because I did something stupid? Probably because I did something stupid. This group has a lot of interaction. That's awesome. That's exactly what I want the live streams to be. The live stream for me, it should be about interaction with you guys. Um, at least for delays. Yeah, I, Some things I don't like about Twitch. We could destroy that. I guess that's probably fine. Um, silence now. I can't do that. Okay, let's just go destroy it, because he's going to probably die at some point. Let's go for that. Okay, now the other ones aren't really useful right now, so let's just go for that. Plus his attack. <laughs> yes, I did, I did put a toilet episode while streaming. It, it just, it's always, um, it's always uh, scheduled to go out at that point. Uh, the store help. Oh, to your hero. Oh, okay, so no, it is just your hero. Sorry about that. Sorry, it's because some other minions do it to anyone, so I was kind of reading it wrong. But yeah, so that's the point, yeah, for you guys who are watching. The stream is meant to be about, I feel, about interaction with you guys. And my normal series is about me creating a, a story, shall we say. So I'd like to keep those two things separate, definitely. Plus three in health. Uh, yeah, we can't use any of these. I want to save these guys. So I guess we just continue making things, but we get no plus attack then. Let's go for that then. For duty. Let's go for that plus some divine shield. How do you heal? Oh yeah, sorry. You were asking the same question. So so far we aren't doing particularly well. We, I mean we've got control of the board, but that's really it. That's all we have right now. But it, I want him just to throw a load of minions down. I enjoy the light roleplay we're doing. I guess that's actually what makes the streams even better. Is normally the uh, is normally the chat. The chat is normally really good for me. I find. Ooh, silencing him would be perfect. Okay, let's silence him. Your magic shall not... I guess we could do a consecration. Then we could attack him with like these two. We could throw this down. Do a shield on this. Attack with these two. So either way, these two are going to die, but then we don't lose the shield. Okay, let's do Consecration then. You're going to ask a lot of dumb questions. Be prepared. Um, mm, okay. 
Oh my god, he has a dragon. <laughs> what will we do? He has a dragon. Oh, and the dragon's dead. Our, our little silver hands killed him. Hey, hey Rabbit King, you know, the, the point is, is that, you know, I, if I let it la last forever, that'd be pretty unfair because sometimes you won't be in the stream and other people will be in the stream. But don't worry, your points kind of add on. Like, if I recognize your name, I'm more likely to give you a position on my council. Um, but yeah. <coughs> now, Nemeth, you just asked me burger or hot dog. And that's a really easy question for me. It's obviously burger. I'm actually not that fond of uh, hot dogs. I don't like the meat in the hot dog, to be honest. But that's just me. Alright, how about we give it to you? We attack him, and we attack with that. Perfect. So I, I don't really like the hot dog taste. The actual taste of the hot dog, I don't particularly like. I'm going to throw out this on this side, and we'll attack with this. Perfect. So that was really easy for me. Then you've gone sword and axe. Uh, sword, I think it's more sort of skillful, for, to be honest. Uh, guitar or drum? Hmm, guitar or drum? I think guitar, I think playing drums is fun and all. It's really fun to play. But guitar just on its own, it can sound really cool. Drums on its own. Drums sound best with other stuff added with it, I find. I love the griffin's head moving like a robot. Why didn't you kill him with only one recruit? Then you would have won more. Ah, uh, you know, we, we won anyway. That's a good point, yeah. It's because for some reason when I saw the 2-1 on the recruit, I was kind of thinking that it had it not because of the dire wolf, but it had it because of the dire wolf. I completely forgot about that. But yeah. Bless you. Cola, Fanta, or Sprite? Hmm. Sprite is definitely the worst one. Sometimes in the, I'm in the mood for a Sprite, but a lot of times I'm not really in the mood for it. Um, so I think Coca-Cola, I, I do like Fanta, but Coca-Cola is great because of the caffeine. I need the caffeine. It gives me just that energy. Yeah, I know, Oaks. I definitely should have done that. I don't know why I did not do that. Uh, Nemeth, booze or cigarettes? Booze. I don't smoke, but I do like to drink. So definitely booze. Definitely. I would call my Valerian Blade Lawbringer because I study law. <laughs> that's, that's actually a good one. I like that. Okay. He's a cider fan. I'm definitely a cider fan. When Merc is summoned, we have no Murlocs. Let's go for this. EU, Asia, USA. Oh, I'm, so, I'm British. <clears throat> Personally, I have to go Europe. Europe is just, even though it's quite small, it has so many countries with so many different cultures and stuff. And just, just so many things. I, I really like that. I'm going to put this down. Then again, you know, I'm going to put this down because I think he might have, like, you know, deal damage to two minions. So I'm going to go for that. And then if he doesn't, I can put that in the middle. I'm going to attack with both of them. Personally, let's say, that, that's just my opinion. I just go for EU because of that. A lot of people obviously won't like the EU. They might prefer Asia. Because that, again, has many different types of places. Copperberg. <gasps> Copperberg. Now, Copperberg is actually pear cider. Um, so it's a bit too sweet. Most people I know would probably not drink it. But yeah. Do you know what? We're going to sacrifice him. But yeah, I, I have to admit, I do like a Copperberg. Because they're just, you know, they're just, they're like, they're nice and sweet. Uh, I'm going to throw this out. I don't want to uh, waste my Dire Wolf, because that's really useful for us. Uh, sunglasses? No sunglasses. You know what? If it's a hot day, I like sunglasses. Fave half stone class, probably paladin. I don't know why. I like the idea of the paladin. Um, I just kind of like it. That's probably deal two damage to all our things. So it was a good job we didn't put down our dire wolf. So I'm just going to attack, I guess. Yep, nothing I can do to save them. I'm sorry, people. How about we attack it just in case it's like something else? Yep, knew it. God damn. Damn you, hunters. But it's fine. We can go for the yeti then. We'll throw out the big guns. Then next I can throw out the dire wolf, give him plus uh, one attack. Could be quite useful. Ah, uh, face re <coughs> face reveal. Now I'm just actually losing my my voice because I'm not drinking. One second. Hmm. 
Ah, there we go. So I just had a quick drink. Someone just said a good pint of Strongbow. Strongbow is like the worst one, to be honest. Strongbow is probably the worst one, I have to, I, I would say. I'm going to throw this out. Just because he can't kill it. I'm just going to go for the attack. Yeah, Strongbow is like the cheapest cider. Strongbow is not particularly that good, I don't think. I mean, in China, I will drink Strongbow because cider is really hard to find. And so having a nice Strongbow is actually really nice. Now, a face reveal. It is something I will plan to do at one point. But right now, I just don't feel my channel's big enough. So I just don't feel uh, like I, I, I should do one. Uh, we should probably just do Consecration. Yeah, let's do Consecration. Um, so I will not be doing it, but it will be later. I might even put that into some like reward system. A lot of people want, you know, I was thinking about doing like a Patreon thing. It might be kind of good to do it like that way. Um, Puddle Stomper. Now, Puddle Stomper or the Dire Wolf or one of these. Let's go for Puddle Stomper. I'm going to attack this as well to get that down because obviously that has one health. Probably I can kill both. You'll probably have to attack. I'm going to go for this. So, um, yeah, so probably no face reveal, but if I do do a Patreon thing, one of the goals will be a face reveal for where I feel then it'd be good for me to have that. Um, never forget, uh, platformer or PC. Now, I grew up playing console games definitely I, I grew up with that I do love console games but I will say that since going to university I started playing PC you know playing all the strategy games and I just love PC now I mean playing a football manager I love to play I love to play uh, paradox games strategy games that type of things so I've really enjoyed that <sighs> Jeeves uh, we could throw Jeeves out Jeeves is not gonna be very helpful though we're just going to throw Jeeves out because he has lots of cards anyway. Um, there's not much I can do really. Hopefully he can try and kill some of these. But yeah, so I, I probably have turned into a PC fan. But I, I do have a, a soft spot for games consoles. But yeah. Fave football club has to be Swansea. If any of you, you know, I, I don't know, probably none of you know us from a very long time ago. I think I said in some recordings, but Swansea is basically my one. Definitely. We probably put these two on him. Destroy that. Let's go for that then, yeah. So uh, gain plus three. Then we gain plus four. There we go. Perfect. There we go. That seems like a good one. Um, no face reveal. I have it in my mind that NG has Valerian features. I don't want to lose that. I, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll say that, okay. <laughs> now that is probably sending it back to my hand, so I probably shouldn't attack him face on. Have you ever played Hand of Fate? I've never played Hand of Fate. Whiskey, cider, or ale? Um, cider. I grew up in the West Country, it has to be cider. I'm sorry, it has to be cider. Okay, let's go for this. Increase our health. And we'll go for this, and next turn I'll go for the Mur Murloc Knight. Now, I know what this is probably going to be, so I'm just going to go destroy them. Oh no, it's... Oh, it does it no matter what. God damn it. I thought it's only if you attack him head on. That was really dumb. Jesus, why did I do that? Okay, that was dumb. Oops. Okay, that's fine. We, we still got this. You shouldn't drink before fight. Didn't you learn that from Oberyn? Yeah, it's fine. What are your PC specs? Okay, I'm just going to say right now, um, I don't actually know. So I'm one of those people who's completely useless when it comes to computers. I literally have no idea about computers. I, I'm completely uncomputer savvy. And basically, I got one of my students where I work to basically make me a computer because... He knows a lot about computers, and so I got him to make me one, and so he made me it. Uh, it's really good though, and it works really well, but I don't really know. <laughs> I don't really know what its stuff is, but yeah. Okay, Murlocs, you got to help us. Okay, there we go, Murlocs, let's go. I'm going to throw this out. 
But yeah, okay, perfect. Alright, any more questions? A lot of questions. Glory, glory, Man United. Yeah, a lot of people like Man United. Man United's okay, but I feel like I don't like a lot of their players recently. I don't know. A lot of players I don't really like that much, to be honest. Um, Seeker 2 EU4 or Mountain Blade? I would probably go for EU4. I feel like EU4 is the game I enjoy the most. Seeker 2 is great, but I do get kind of bored of that sometimes. Mountain Blade just takes so much time that it's just insane. That is probably deal 2 damage, I would guess. Maybe, but yeah, okay. Um, dye your hair white. Well, who says I need to dye my hair? Maybe my hair is already white. Maybe I already look Valerian. Who knows? Um, my music, favorite music is rock music then. Love me some rock music. Consecration, obviously. It's probably the best thing to do. A consecration, and then we'll throw him down, Jeeves. But we'll attack first. So many, so many traps. No, my Murloc Knight. And now he costs six. Ah, oh, god damn it! I'm gonna throw down the Murloc Knight. No, because he can just kill it. Damn. Okay, send out Jeeves. I get one card. I've really been paying less attention to this game. I've been paying more attention to the chat. This is when it kind of gets distracting. If you ever get into YouTube on a streaming, I don't think I'd face cam. I like the love child of Jon Snow and Sam Waltali. Hey, that, that's, that's probably not too bad. You know, nothing wrong with those guys. So he's going in for the kill right now. Yeah, he, he's going straight in for the kill because he wants to get those cards. He's not killing Jeeves. Damn him, he's not killing Jeeves. That's what we wanted. Okay, well, a Neutron will annoy him, so that'll be good. Hopefully he gets lots of animals, we can then use mind control. And we'll throw this out, and then I'll bring someone in. Murloc, go! Oh, all you have a Murloc's up plus two plus one. Excellent, that's exactly what I need. Um, I need a four attack. Now, should I let him also use Jeeves? I think not. I need to get, I'm going to get rid of Jeeves. Because I now have the Murloc Knight out. As long as the Murloc Knight is protected, we're fine. And he he could kill the Murloc Knight, we'll see. We'll see. Maybe he doesn't know the strength, the OPness of our Murloc Knight. We'll show him. The uh, favorite band? Oh, um, favorite band, that's a really difficult question. Probably Red Hot Chili Peppers. Just because it's, I, I don't really like bands. I normally just like songs, but... Oh, that's actually a really good time to use that. You sneaky devil. No, Murloc Knight. No. Our precious Murloc Knight, but we can use our mind control guy. So it's not all bad. Ooh, we can get more health. Okay, perfect. And we got. Eh, that's not. That, that could have been worse, to be honest. Let's get some more health. Perfect. Okay, let's kill off this. That gets rid of a four killer. And. Mm hmm. I could kill him. We have no more mur Murlocs, so I'm going to go kill him. Get rid of his damage. You know, hunters are all about making the damage, so let's get rid of those. Um, Alright, wall or beyond the wall? Oh, that's actually a good question. I didn't even think about that, but really, that's actually a good question, because I guess... Oh my god, he gave up. We won! People, we won another one. You guys made a pretty good deck, actually. I don't mean to sound like I'm surprised, but I'm just, uh, I'm surprised. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'd probably go for the wall, just because, you know, the, the brotherhoodly, you know, stuff like that. Beyond the wall, I feel like I would not fare so well, just because of the whole, like, you know, basically like the strong win. I'm more smart than I am strong, to be honest. But yeah. I will definitely live stream some more Seeker 2 every Sunday, that will be. This is more of a test. CK2 and other things will be definitely every Sunday, and if I can, other times. Um, Sunday, Captain, if we need help, Mr. Weber's hired. Okay, thanks. No problem. Have you seen Full Metal, Alchem uh, Full Metal Alchemist? I have watched Full Metal Al Alchemist, both versions, the, uh, the Brotherhood and the old version. Love Full Metal Alchemist. It was a great anime. 
have to admit though, I was pretty late to animes. Um, I only really got into them when I went to college, because basically everyone started showing me them. Okay, let's, 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 actually I got a lot of high costing things, so let's leave our, let's leave our coin for now. But no, I love Full Metal Alchemist. I really love that. Favorite film series? That is a tough question as well. If I just have to go to the top of my head, uh, one of my f I, I love comedy. Comedy is probably my favorite thing. So when it comes to when it comes to t uh, films, I probably like Oh Brother Where Art Thou. Oh Brother Where Art Thou is one of my favorite movies, just because I can watch it again and again, and it's just so enjoyable. It's just an enjoyable movie. Fave kingdom in a song of ice and fire. Ooh, um, favorite kingdom. That's a hard one to say. Um, I've, I've always liked the Arons, just because I like the whole Hire's Honor. Um, I've always liked that. I could go for Consecration, actually. Let's go for Consecration. As you know, it's Shaman. There's so many things we can kill with Consecration. Let's leave it. I bet he has lots of things to do for that. Okay, let's go for the Yeti. I think getting the Yeti out would be useful here. But yeah, um, so I, I can't really choose. I always like the Aaron's though. I like the house words. High as honor. You predicted five wins, just saying. We could get five wins, maybe. Fave capital in the Song of Ice and Fire. King's Landing, to be honest. But I mean, if you want me to choose out the others, I guess we have Storm's End. Storm's End's a bit meh. A bit boring, I think. High Garden sounds kind of nice. Castle Rock is kind of cool. You know, literally in a mountain. Or the Eerie, I guess. Hmm. Definitely Castly Rock or the Eerie. Now we have another Consecration. That is actually quite nice. Huh. Could throw him out, kill him. Consecration. Hmm. Let's, let's, let's leave the Consecration. Could throw him out. Let's just kill that, because we're going to kill that anyway. Uh, he'll probably attack me now with that, but that's fine. And I'm going to summon this. But yeah, I'd probably go for the Eerie or Castle Rock for favorite capital. Favorite, A Song of Ice and Fire, Dragon. Um, Balerion the Dread, I guess you have to go with. He's just the greatest dragon. Uh, Full Metal Alchemist, when you can't afford daycare for your kid and pet sitting for your dog. Okay, Coin Yeti. I, I, that was a long time ago, um, Ronald. I think maybe you're a bit far behind. You might have to refresh your stream. The best King's Guard is obviously Boris Blunt. Definitely not. He's a horrible King. He's probably the worst one. Um, where would you think you'd live if you were born in the Seven Kingdoms? Well, I guess I'd probably base it on because I'm from England. <laughs> so because I'm from England, I'd probably go for something silly. Archer Funkus, you know Oh Brother Who Art Thou. That is, yeah, that's one of my favorite movies. I don't know why. It just always has been. Uh, let's give the arcane nullifier, I guess. There's not much I can do here, yeah. Yep, can't really do much here. Uh, we'll do the avenge. He'll give him extra power. Also, then it leaves him guessing, thinking what this is. It's kind of hard playing and trying to read the, the chat at the moment because there's so many questions coming out from the chat. Um, okay. You feel I was born in the Seven Kingdoms. That was the question. I guess the Riverlands. I feel like I'd probably be born in the Riverlands for some reason. That just feels like where I'd be from. Ah, okay, smart move. Um, yeah, okay, as your hand, I can only say matter King Rabbit can ask for now. Favorite medieval weapon? I have no idea, actually. We thought you was a toad. Yes, perfect, I love that. We thought you was a, a toad. Do not seek. The treasure. Sorry, that's just some Oh Brother What Art Thou stuff. I love that movie. I, I The first time I watched it, I did not see the part where it was based on the Odyssey. And by watching it, I realized it was. And that made me kind of fall in love in it. Did I read the books? I've read, I guess, Game of Thrones twice. That That's it, actually. I've only read the books twice. But yeah. Um, I should probably do this, because we kill a lot of them. And we have a second one left, then. And we can kill that. Yeah, might as well. There's not really much choice we have at the moment. He's used up a lot of his cards, so... We've, we've kind of gotten to kill off most of his stuff. There we go. Now I'll use this. So there we go. I have four cards. 
He'll now have four cards. Favorite spell? Uh, what do you mean by favorite spell? I'm not sure you mean what you mean in, in this game. Favorite full metal alchemist homunculus. Mine is Wrath from Brotherhood. Yeah. Um. Wh whoever is the, uh, the the leader guy, I forget his name. I think it, I I forgot him because I know in both of the different ones he changes which one he is. I can't remember. That's going to be annoying. But I could obviously do uh, this. <laughs> That's actually pretty good, actually. We could just do this. Yeah, let's just do this. There we go. Had to edit. We had to get rid of that, so. But yeah, I can't remember. It's the guy, whoever is the leader of the the stuff. I don't want. I don't want to ruin it because I don't know if people have watched it. I can't remember his name. It was so long ago. I watched Full Metal Alchemist. But yeah, uh, I was watching with my father. This is literally a Q&A with NG Paradox. It is basically turned into it. That's what I mean, you know. A lot of people don't like this type of thing, so it kind of allows you to ask questions. From Hearthstone. Ooh. Um, probably uh, the Mage's Damage 10, just because that's so much fun to do. Okay, we have the Frostwolf. I could just do my own one. That could be more useful, actually. Now, how about we do that? Then we can throw out, you know, give him Divine Shield again. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, I can attack him and give him divine shield again. Who do I think is the right king queen for Restoras? Right, not rightful. Um, I, I, I always felt Renly, to be honest. I, I know a lot of people disagree, but I always felt Renly was right in some ways. He actually would have made a good king. But I know a lot of people disagree. I know that's just, that's just always been my opinion. I always. I really would have fought for Renly. But if you're talking about who is rightfully. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah, I should have got rid of the shield of the dude. Actually, that is a good point. I should have done that. I could do that next turn, though. So I can get rid of it, kill it, and then also give him back his shield. But yeah. Let's get rid of that. He gives extra things to Mech, so I can then just kill him. Yeah, there's nothing else to... Yep, yeah, okay. Now I'm going to throw out some minions, just to give us some more. So I'm going to throw this out. Give it to him. That would just because he tried to damage us because it's plus one. Uh, we can throw out some more stuff, because like I say, I want to get things out for the Frost Wolf Warlord. We can't attack of anything, so I'm just going to put this out, because we can get more health. Perfect. Um, but yeah, sorry, I, I have not been looking at the, the things for Vong. But yeah, Renly is kind of one I would choose. And if you're going for a rightful king, there literally is no rightful king because it's so messed up. Um, and it depends how you define rightful. Technically, technically, Stannis is the rightful king because his brother had it. And luckily, he stole one of our bad ones. That was lucky. He could have taken our forced tank. But yes, yeah, so you could say Stannis is the rightful king because obviously he is technically the next one in line. But then again, Daenerys... It was taken from her family, so does that mean they're the rightful kings? It's very annoying. It's a very frustrating question, and really there's no correct answer. But yeah, um, back to the questions then. Favorite non-capital city in A Song of Ice and Fire? Um, I, 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 I'm not sure at all for that one. Favorite Red Hot Chili Peppers song? Oh, um, that's easy. I lo you know what? Californication is kind of like my childhood. Let's go for this then. Yeah, let's just throw this out. Let's see what we get. Okay, that was bad. We could have got better. Um, I can throw this out. But yeah. Let's throw that out. Throw out our Frost Wolf Commander. This is an all-out battle now. <laughs> we both kind of got out our lines. That this is what we have. I'm just going straight into attack. Because I just want to kill him. But yeah, okay. So back to the questions. Uh... Favorite Red Hot Chili Peppers song? Uh, Californication is kind of like my childhood, so that's always been my favorite. Um, but there's one other I l I've been really listening to a lot recently. I can't remember what it's called now. Why? It's kind of just popped up off my head, so I do apologize. Uh, get rid of a shield with the dude. Yeah, Renly. Victarion for king. <laughs> Rhaegal would have been a good king. I think you mean Rhaegar? Rhaegal is... Uh, Though he switches the hand, it was quite a bit. Oh, okay, you're talking about 
You, you mean Rhaegar, I think, but yeah, Rhaegar. You're talking about in my game, yeah. Do you know all banners and main houses? I probably, yeah, I basically do. And I've won. There we go. Perfect. Wow, you guys actually made a pretty good deck. Um, but yeah. Come and play Game of Thrones RP mod for Mountain Blade with me. I'm sorry, Awesome Cat. I can't right now. I'm, I'm too busy with the live stream. And then I have to go to sleep. <laughs> so I can't really do that. Um, but yeah, I, I actually, I probably do know all the banners of the main houses. And probably most of the minor lords. Um, that's what playing the mod can do to you. The mod basically has made me just remember everything. Have I seen Attack on... I have not seen Attack on Titan. I don't know why. I've been meaning to watch that for so long. Because um, a lot of people said it's good. But I've heard then some people said it got a bit bad. I've heard a lot of mixed things about it. But it's one I've been meaning to watch. I just never had the chance. But yeah. Do you know at least one non-capital city for each kingdom? Um, obviously in the north you have the Mandalese White Harbour. Um, in the Riverlands? I... Not really sure if there's a city, um, but in the area, obviously, you have Gull Town, which I guess would be a city. Uh, obviously, there's the the High Tower. Obviously, the High Tower's land that I guess is one. Yeah, we'll just throw you out. I should, I should just yeah. Yeah, we'll just throw him out. But yeah, I, I guess there's a few, um, but I don't know many of them. There's a few. Stormlands can't think of one. Uh, Lannis Port, I guess, is a city possibly. But yeah, I'm not exactly sure how many there are. I can't remember. Cat the King is buzzy, but I can come. <laughs> 12 wins coming. Favorite Warcraft lore character? You know what? I have no idea. Never played World, World of Warcraft. Don't like World of Warcraft. <laughs> which sounds really silly right now because I'm playing Hearthstone, which is basically based Maidenpool. I guess Maidenpool is a city. Yeah, Old Town, obviously, yeah, yeah, sorry. But yeah, uh, Warcraft, look, I, I don't like, uh, I don't like Warcraft. I hate the game World of Warcraft. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people like it, but I've just never been fond of it. Let's just give ourselves Divine Shield and kill him. Now, I think we're doing quite well, so I'm going to do this... Guess another uh, little guy. Let's get things rolling quickly here. There's not a lot of cities. No, there's not. Favorite hero power. I, I really like the reinforce. I, I love having, you know, just being able to appear a little guy. <laughs> now, is it the best one? Probably not. Probably the best one is possibly, uh, Possibly uh, the mage, I guess, doing one damage to anything is really useful sometimes. This means he probably has a big demon up, so I don't really want to kill him. Yeah, I probably don't want to kill him, but I I'm going to go for a hungry dragon. Yeah, let's go for a hungry dragon. Let's see what pops up. I can probably kill it. Okay, one damage. I can probably kill it with you. There we go, now I have a big dragon out. It didn't cost me, it just cost me one damage, so that's fine. And we won't attack him. A city for the Iron Islands. Uh, I don't sure there is a city for the Iron Islands. Have you seen the room? I've not seen the room. I know a lot of people have talked about it. Oh, are you bloody kidding me? He did four damage. I've never actually seen the room though, but I know a lot of people talk about it. Okay, this is bad. This is bad. Lord's Port. Oh yeah, Lord's Poor, yeah, that's a good one. Has not spoken yet. Back, favourite Crownlands house. Oh, Crownlands house. Ugh. By what? Fawn? I like Fawn. I like Alistair Fawn. You know what, so I'm going to go for Fawns. But yeah, we're in trouble. I guess I could use my Blessing of Kings, but he has 8 health. So I could use the Blessings of Kings and the Seal of Champions. But yeah, plus 2 attack. Ha. Huh. You know, let's throw you out. Give him plus two attack. We're going to attack him to lower down his health. But yeah. Uh, we can't destroy it all. But yeah, we'll just, we'll just take out some of these. We'll take out these guys. I said I like to have control of the board. And next turn, then we can obviously use this and this. 
But he can oh no, he can destroy he can destroy both my minions, but all his minions are destroyed, so I don't think he'll do that. But yeah. Uh favorite crown lands out. Yeah, I, I guess fawn probably. Probably fawn. Imps for days, yep, yeah, those damn imps. What do I think about greed from Full Metal Alchemist? He had the best charisma. <laughs> he had the best that was that was a good play by him just then. That was a good play by him. Damn it. It's probably in a bad spot, actually. Let's go for health. Yeah. Um, yeah, greed. Yeah, I thought greed. greed. Greed's okay, I guess. I, I prefer him in Full Metal Brotherhood because it just made it more interesting with the other character who then takes it. Um, so that was kind of interesting, but eh, overall, greed's okay. Wasn't that interested in him actually, to be honest. He was kind of cool, but not the most interesting. Favorite Dornish house has to be Danes or Yonwoods, I have to say. They feel like the most fleshed out ones. Yeah, we're in trouble here. Murloc Knight, please save me. Okay, gives him plus one attack. That doesn't really help us, but fine. Um. House Stockworth's the best Crownland house because of Bronn. Yeah, but Bronn's not really a Stockworth yet. We'll see. To ask the mighty NG. Favorite hero portrait. Hmm. Favorite hero portrait. I don't know. They're all they're all kind of there. Favorite background. Favorite background. What, what do you mean by that? Do you mean like this background here? Now we do have consecration. That could, uh, nine nine. That's gonna be. Pain. Obviously, though, we do have silence and minion. Your magic shall not save you. Let's do that. And we can do two damage. I need to get myself saved. Plus four, plus four. And that's not going to help us kill these two, is it? Plus three. Okay, how about we go for that? We give it to him, and he kills him. There's six, nine, no. If I do that, kills them. We can kill him as well. Hmm. I have to get. I'm gonna have to just try. If I kill him, I could use them both to kill him. So I, I use both to kill him. That's six damage. We have to get rid of that. But I think we've lost this one, actually, guys. I think we've lost this one. Um, we haven't spoken for too long, and Killer Boy took your place. Um, will you do a Glenmore playthrough? That's actually a really nice point. I've. That's actually going to go on my list, I think. I did not think about doing a Glenmore playthrough, but that could be a really nice long one. That could be my next long Let's Play. I actually quite like that one. Um, the backgrounds. Yeah, the backgrounds I don't really care about to be honest. I haven't really taken much notice of them. Vave Zero Mana Minion. <laughs> uh, there's not many of them. I don't know. But I'm dead. We're dead. Oh my god, we got the card that will save us. Go, you for Brewmaster. Now let's make him ultimate and powerful. Let's make him ultimate. There we go, the ultimate brewmaster. He is undefeatable. And now we give up. Because we've lost this one. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, well there we go. So I think that's four now. I think that's four. No, six. Oh, jeez, I got six wins. This, this just should... I've not been paying attention at all. I've been paying more attention to the chat. You guys are too distracting in the chat. There's only Wisp and Target Dummy, yeah. Um, I guess Target Dummy? I don't know, there's the Druid card that allows you to uh, summon like four, or four, five Wisps? Is it five Wisps or four Wisps? I like that card, that's kind of fun. You put that out and give them the Death Rattle to summon, you know, 2-2 two, two Trent. That's kind of fun. In the next installment of Telltale's Game of Thrones, if you could decide the fate of House Whitehill, what will you decide? Kill them. Kill them all. I mean it. I actually don't give a shit anymore. Uh, the White Hills totally lost all my respect. Complete any resp uh, I didn't really respect them anyway. But I had sympathy because they're people. But they've totally lost all of my sympathy. Com uh, I don't even want to talk about it actually. You know what? I'm so upset. I don't even want to talk about it. Don't, don't mention the Telltale Game of Thrones thing. I just... Thinking back to Asher just gives me nightmares. One of my favorite characters. 
Why does someone just put Kung Fu Panda? <laughs> what is that? Would you do a Warden play for a walk? Um, yeah, I guess I could do like um, the guy has like whatever it is. He has like lots of them or something. We're just gonna throw out some cheap things. So I know he's gonna use the Fire Blast. There's not much I can do at this point. He definitely has the advantage here. Fave neutral legendary. Um, fave neutral legendary. I, I like True Hearts because I, I like being able to change the uh, the hero power into a better one. I think that's kind of cool. It's simple, but it's fun, I think. Okay, let's go for this. Yeah, let's put it there, attack. Okay, yeah. Even Gwyn. Hmm. I, I know what you mean. Gwyn is a nice girl. Um, I think if I was if if I was Asher, that's the thing that worries me, I think. I think a lot of people play Asher might find that they might be less inclined, more inclined to be nice, and that might end up getting you killed, I bet. I could just imagine them doing that. But yeah. I could throw him out, could throw another one out. Guess we should probably kill this. We should probably kill that as well. Too much stuff. You can plus four plus four. That doesn't really help me right now. We don't need to do that. Okay, how about we can't kill that, so let's just go for this. And we throw out this. And we throw out this. And we attack that. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, Varamir six skins. Yeah, I could always be him. Um, are you are you the players of Night's Watch Deserter? That is something I've been thinking about. I, I want to do that. The only problem with that is, um, if you play as a Night's Watch Deserter, you get no CBs basically, so it's really difficult and take a long time. But that was one I actually had planned to do, um, but I just felt like it would be too long. Um, House Whitehill won't die. Telltale will probably make. Yeah, I agree. I, I think it will probably end with uh, you dying sadly. And they'll do a season two. That's what I think will probably happen. I agree, actually, yeah. Um, what do we do here? I could destroy that. Murloc, if only we could get your plus one, plus one, it'd be perfect right now. But we can't. Now, I could give him plus four, plus four, and we could kill him, and we could kill him. You know, that's what I'm going to do. The Clear the board. We need to, we need to do that. We have to clear the board. Now, do I throw this out, which you'll probably just use the kill? Actually, I will, because it will waste his mana. Hopefully, it means he can't kill him. So, there we go. I expect stuff with Daenerys if there's a season two. Yep, probably, uh, you know, Malcolm off there with Daenerys. He'll probably be a cat. I think he'll probably be... You'll probably continue playing as um, the Tuttle. You know, you'll probably continue playing as Tuttle beyond the wall. You'll probably be Malcolm. You'll probably be... Uh, Mira will probably survive in King's Landing, probably. And then you'll probably be T Talia in Iron Wrath. I think that's what will probably happen in Season 2. But yeah, it's not looking so good. Muckler's champion. Could throw out Muckler. But I feel like they're going to have a uh, destroy everything thing. But there's nothing to silence. Let's just go for that then. I'm going to leave it out. I want to have six for that. Yep, let's leave it. I must away. Farewell, friends. Farewell, Rabbit King. Farewell, my Master of Laws, if I remember correctly. Have a good day. Malcolm and Daenerys. You know what? Wouldn't surprise me. Daenerys has done enough stuff already. <laughs> that sounds terrible, doesn't it? Six, five. Here. We could easily destroy him. But knowing... Uh, him, he probably can destroy us as well. That's free. Throw him out. I could do that. And then we'd have. But only free health we could destroy it next turn. Okay, let's throw this out. I think it's the only choice we have. Okay, there we go. I think Talia will go to Rillwater Crossing. Possibly. What do you think will happen with Marcel? Marcel. Ah, do you mean in the books or do you mean in the TV show? Because in the TV show, um, <laughs> I guess I guess that's already been answered. What do you think of Wrath from Brotherhood? 
I like they made him Bradley isn't of that little shitty kid. What? I have no idea, Joshua, what you're asking here. Raph? Oh, Raph from, uh, Raph from Full Metal Alchemist, yes. Um, yeah, yeah, I, I think he was much better in Brotherhood. Yeah, the little kid was kind of annoying. Yeah, I'm glad they did that. I agree. I concur. What to do here now? I could give him Divine Shield, attack him, then you can just firebomb him, so that seems pretty useless. Get him to have that, could throw this out. Yeah, I don't really see anything that's particularly useful for me. Let's go for this then, let's throw out something big. He'll probably then try to destroy it. Let's see what happens. She would migrate to her sister-in-law. Uh, who has a Hearthstone account so that I can add him, her? I do! <laughs> I'm hoping my Astrid survives and once all said and done, marries Gwyn like he tried before he was exiled. Yeah, that's what, that's what I think. I think a lot of people will... Ma that, that's kind of... I always assume the end of the season would be Asha marrying Gwyn, bringing the two families together. Now, this has probably destroyed the minion that attacks, so I'm going to go attack. Or it's like, you know, copy. Okay, it's not. Interesting. Huh. Interesting indeed. Now, I wouldn't mind silencing that. I wouldn't mind doing a, a muckler as well. Do that, do that, I could do that. So, that's nine. He probably can kill me, I'm suspecting. I have a suspecting feeling that he can kill me, so I'm gonna... Duh. Should probably kill this, yeah. Okay, let's do that. Okay. Muckless champion. We'll go for Puddle Stomper, and we'll go for this. And he'll give everyone plus one, plus one. There we go. Bananas for all. Bananas for all. Now, I'll probably get that twice, yeah. God damn it. I should have killed... I knew I should... Now, that's, that's going to kill all my people. No! God damn it! God damn you all! EU, USA... You've already asked this question, EU or USA. Ah, uh, there we go. Yeah, I knew it was going to come up at some point. Well, I think this guy's beat me here, actually. He, he did a good game, actually. We ever do a Let's Play of Tales from the Borderlands? Now, I've never been a fan of Borderlands. I, I've played the games, but I just could never get into them for some reason. I don't know why. Now, I can't put out the Hungry Dragon, because 2-2, two, two, that's 4. He just needs 4 attack. Oh, actually, 3 attack. I don't feel like I can do that, but I can do this. And I can do this. And we'll give him Divine Shield. That's all I can do for now. Um, but yeah, I know a lot of people like it, but I just, I'm not a fond of the Borderlands. So, I, I don't know what happens there. Maybe in the future, we'll see. We'll see how people feel. If people like it, then definitely a chance. Uh, I'm dead now. There we go. Perfect. I very much dislike Daenerys. Not what she has done in Slayer's Bay that I can get behind, but her as a character, I just don't like her. You know what? I actually agree. In general, I'm not that fond of Daenerys either. Just as a character, just never interested me. I fought in the first book, pretty good. Uh, second book, this kind of went downhill for me. But you know what? Actually, this, this uh, arena wasn't too bad. We actually got six wins. So for a deck that you guys helped basically create, which actually you guys basically created, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I mean, to go. Uh, Alexandra, of course, have a good night. Foresters and White Hills were once very close, and a forester is always a forester, just as a White Hill is always a White Hill. Yep. Bye, Renly. Bye. What fate do you think will rate Lud and his son Griff in episode 6? Um, I think you will be able to kill Griff. I, I think there'll be a scene where you can kill Griff. But, ooh, that's pretty good. Ooh, that's pretty nice. I like that. Um, but I think Lud will probably survive. I feel like I think you're gonna fail and die. Let's see what we have in these packs. Let's try the classic one first. What do we have here? Okay, nothing. Nothing. <gasps> oh my god, a rare. Oh, an epic. Let's have a look. Let's see what we got. Okay, explosive shot. Deal 5 damage to a minion, 2 damage to the adjacent ones. That's great. I actually don't have this one, so I'm quite happy with that. And that's a really good one, actually. And the epic is hungry, hungry crap. Are you, hung, are you hungry? What a useless bloody thing. I mean, if you're doing a Murloc deck or your opponent's doing Murloc, that's kind of good, I guess. But yeah, I already got one. I don't really want two, to be honest. 
Legend hype. Let's go for the legend, guys. Boom. I bet you there's a legend. There has to be. D Damn it. <gasps> a rare. Oh my god, there we go, guys. Oh my Jesus Christ. What the hell is the chance? <laughs> what? Oh my god, it's a double legend. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> that is amazing. I have hardly any legends. That is absolutely hilarious. Oh my god, that is hilarious. Oh yeah, it's a kind of rare. Ah, oh, I just love that. Coliseum manager. I do not have a Coliseum manager. So return this minion to your hand. Let's have a look at the first one then, guys. I don't have like any legends from uh from the, I only have two legends, I think. But yeah, yeah, you're right, Isaac. Livestream luck really does work. Let's go. What is it? Adric the Pure. Change your minions attack to one. Now, I actually I don't think this is that good, just because I feel like a lot of people doing a uh, paladin. A lot of people doing paladin are basically going to go with uh, a lot of uh, silver hammer recruits. So giving them all one attack to the opponent maybe won't help too much. I guess it depends. Though, later on, they might have more health. So yeah, okay, this could be good though. I, I like paladin. This I'm quite happy to have a legend. It's my first legend for paladins. I'm quite happy. Come on, be a golden, golden. My first golden legendary. Damn it. But it's an acid maw, which again I do not have, so that is awesome. Whenever another random ta a minion takes damage, destroy it. That is awesome. I like this one actually. I know, I think a lot of people, I'm not sure what people have been saying about it, but I saw a few people say they didn't really like it. And the same for Edric the Pure. Um, but yeah, I think acid maw could be really useful, um, especially if you put it with certain cards. But yeah, there's definitely better legends out there. But you know what? Overall, that's a pretty good get.